Hey you guys and welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Erica. Um, I am coming back with this simple cute look. I am about to go bowling with my family and I wanted to do something cute and laid back. I'm wearing this little one piece jumper from a local store in Fort Wayne that I live in. I'm not sure where I got it from. I just went shopping so I gotta figure it out. But yes, I am so excited. Um, I completed this cute, um, simple orange type of vibe glam. Stay tuned. Don't forget to follow my social media listed down below. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave some love for me. I will see you guys in my next video. Mwah. So I'm gonna hop into my Morphe primer. Um, I just started using this and love that. And I'm using a serum for my face as well, mixed in with my primer. And I got that from iHerb.com. Um, I'll list it down below for you guys. It's a good serum to use for a primer. And then I'm going to get my eye base going. I'm using that Tarte Taper. And I'm going to get my um, eyes all set in and make sure when I add my foundation, it's all popping. So then I'm gonna use that Morphe palette. I'm gonna go straight to that um, peachy orange is what I like to call it. And I'm just gonna get that smoked into my skin. It seems much darker on the palette, but looks super different on my skin. And I actually was not mad at it. So I was excited. So as you guys can see, I'm gonna build that color up right in my crease and I'm um, just working that in there and just letting it sit for a second and just working on the other eye as well. And I'm just going to get a nice base going. I just really want it very orange right in that crease. As you can see, I'm really blending that in there. And then I'm going to also take the Morphe palette that I'm holding. I'm going to use that deep uh, brown. And I'm going to get that smoked on the outer corners of that foundation. And just get a nice smoky bronzy look going at the top as well. And I was just really feeling this look as I was doing it. I was like, okay, sis, you're cute. And just keep that going um, and just really just blending um, till uh, my arms are tired and blend some more. So now I'm just taking that brown still. I'm just getting everything smoked in um, and just getting a nice um, fall. I, yeah, this is a fall vibe, honestly, or spring. It could be spring because it's orange. And then I'm going to go back to that tart taper. I'm going to cut my crease and then I'm going to jump back to that Morphe and I'm going to get that um, orange uh, shimmer and I'm going to get that on my eyelids as well. And this shimmer is so pretty. Like as you, it's so, I thought it was so pretty. So my eyes are all set. I'm going to get my lashes on and my eyeliner. I'm going to be using that new Morphe um, matte foundation. I'm going to be mixing it with the Makeup Revolution foundation because the Morphe could be a little bit dry because I'm neutral skin. So I have to get a little bit of oil mixed in there. And that's why I make sure I get a good base on my skin so that it could sit well. Which if you do those steps, it will look good. Like, like you see now, it doesn't look ashy or anything like that. It's, it's very matte um, and I really like it. So I was really happy with that. Um, so yeah, if you're neutral skin like me, use some type of oil base um, before you add this foundation because it's going to need something to grasp onto. And then as you can see, it's just, it's really like matte. It's not, you don't see like much dewy or anything like that. I actually like it this way. I do. I like a, a simple um, color and I was really enjoying this. So yeah, now I'm going to take that pro concealer. As you can see, I'm getting that in my areas. Um, under my eyes, nose, widows, whatever you want to call that, Cupid's bow, yeah. And just blending everything out with my favorite beauty blender, which, since we have to get a new one, she is done for. So, I just actually purchased some more, so I'm pretty excited to crack those open. And yeah, I'm just blending away, blending, blending away. And, like, I don't know. I just really like that foundation. It, something that's like, okay, we like it. Now I'm using the Black Radiance Setting Powder. This is very, like, this is exactly close to my skin. And this is, like, what I was going for because um, my mom likes, not my mom, my dad likes to take a lot of pictures. And he likes to use the flash. And so I just wanted to make sure um, I didn't have any flashback from a lighter um, baking powder. And then I'm using the Black Radiance Contour Palette. I'm going to get my contour going a little bit. Something super soft, super simple. Um, nothing extra. And just get everything smoked out. Going back to that uh, 
black radiance and just dust away that excess contour with that powder it's both neutral so it all blends together in my skin and it all sits well with my skin i just found some great products that just really work with my skin going back to that morphe using that deep brown and just getting that under my eye to get like a nice smoky under look going and I think I kind of mixed it with um, like a reddish orange that was in there. And then now I'm just getting a little highlight in the crease of my eye. And I'm just going to bronze up um, with L'Oreal Bronzer and highlight with the Carly Bible Highlight Palette. So yeah, this is the look. I thank you guys so much for tuning in. I will see you in my next video. Stay tuned. Love you guys. Peace. Uh, 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 uh.